If you want a cheaper and faster way to get Rocket League items, head over to RL Exchange and use code Coke. They have tons of your favorite items to choose from, so you can build the car that you've always wanted. And the best part is they deliver these items to any console insanely fast and have tons of payment methods that you can choose from. Just use the link in the description to go check it out for yourself. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing another Rocket League crate opening video. This time we have 50 Golden Gift 22s to try and open a Titanium White mainframe for the very first time in Coral Coke history. And speaking of Titanium White items, every thousand subs on this channel, we give away a Titanium White Octane to one of you. And all you have to do to enter is subscribe to the channel and comment something down below. It's... There's no way, there's no shot. I just got a mainframe on the first crate of the video. These are real crates, guys. 50 real Golden Gift 22s. Imagine if I opened with a white octane. Imagine the clips. Oh, man. What a way to start, though. Juggler mainframe. Ah, that would have been really nice painted. I'm just saying, like, I was just talking about... Would have been the first white octane in Coral Coke history, open from a crate. Dude, that's actually insane. I, don't, I can't remember the last time I got a black market on the very first crate of a video. Another juggler item, thank you for two juggler <laughs> items. <laughs> wow. I, I don't know what to say by that. <laughs> like usually I try and get to the opening as quickly as possible when I'm doing my intro because I don't like you know, my intros being too long. I like to just get to the point, especially when I've got 50 crates to open for you guys. But. <gasps> oh, exotic, let's go. Dude, exotic and black market in the first five crates. Dude, this is gonna be, this is gonna be a good opening. I think my last crate opening was really good too. If I remember correctly, I got like three black markets out of 50. And this is my second crate opening in season 10. So, so far, season 10 crate openings are absolutely insane. <laughs> I still can't believe that. Like, I saw the glow of the black market. I was like, what? There's no way. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys are having a great day. Hope you guys had a good April. No way! There's no way! There's no way, bro! Stop! Season 10, what are you doing? It's a 1% chance for black market, not a 10% chance. Not a 50% chance, a 1% chance. And I've already gotten two. I, I know they're not painted. That could have been a white mainframe and a white shattered. It could have been crazier, but I'm not gonna complain. Ch uh, uh, <laughs> I, I, dude, eight crates. <laughs> okay, this has potential to be my best crate opening ever. And I don't put that lightly. Like. A mainframe and a shattered in eight crates. Ah, my heart can't take this, bro. Y'all are gonna think I'm faking it. Y'all are gonna think like I'm faking. This is a genuine reaction. Like I'm actually shocked right now. Oh my, imagine I was doing a cr Oh, an alarm went off. I woke up a little bit early, sorry. Uh -uh. During a video, alarm goes off. That's kind of cringe. Let me just turn that off. Yep, turn that off. Okay, I set a lot of alarms. Okay, I'm sorry. It's currently 6 in the morning, uh, and I post at 9. Got up kind of early today, uh, because I went to bed really early. But, uh, yeah. Wow. What a way to start the crate opening. Uh, exotic, two black markets, and we're only 13 crates in. <laughs> Reaper? Okay. Dude, Golden Gift 22s, though, are the greatest crate in Rocket League. The fact that there's Reapers, Shattered... Like Draco Zamba's mainframe. Dude, stop, stop. Oh, still, still though. We're gonna have trade ups at the end. Two exotics, two black markets. I, what I was saying before the alarm stopped me. Uh, imagine this was a crate battle. Like we'd each have 25 crates. I would be crushing the other person right now. I would be brutally destroying them. Like it's not even funny. <laughs> I wish I could have this luck. I did a crate battle with Trihouse. N me and him did not get a single exotic or black market out of 50 crates, 25 each. And I've already gotten four, two of each. But man, <laughs> you know, I wish, 
I wish I could explain it, but I can't. I just can't explain it. There's some times where I open up 100 crates and I get nothing. I think my worst crate opening ever, I opened 100 of a, like a brand new crate and I got one exotic and zero black markets. And then there's openings like this. <sighs> okay, see, but now I get to like the greedy part of Coral where I'm like, okay, but now to make it the best, I would need four. Because I've gotten three black markets in an opening, I think two or three times. I want to say three times I've gotten three. But I don't think I've ever gotten four from an opening. I've gotten four total, like three from the opening and then one or two from trade-ups. Ooh, black chakrams. Those are nice. But I've never gotten four from opening four of them. Like, that's always been the number I can't hit. So now I'm just thinking, is it world? Is it coral record time? Not world record, but <laughs> coral coke record. Come on, two more, please. Rare Venom Retro Sun. I'm really hoping that this trade up that we do at the end though gives us some good luck. Last time we ended on a trade up and it was traded up to a mainframe and it was the Golden Gift 22 series, but it wasn't painted. Like my painted luck with mainframes is so bad. And of course, it's kind of like my luck with painted octanes when I do very rare trade ups. It's like the game knows that. I make videos out of trying to get a white octane and trying to get a white mainframe and it knows not to give it to me because if I did get it one day, then I wouldn't be able to say like, oh, we're trying to get it for the very first time in Coral Coke history, guys. It's like, that's the whole fun of the journey is to like try and get it for the first time. But once you get it for the first time, okay, I'll admit, I would actually probably enjoy getting it for the first time and then going for it a second time rather than just never getting it in my entire life <laughs> like yes the journey's fun but getting it is also fun you know it'd be a great clip <sighs> i'm a little jealous when i like watch pick a pixel's channel and i see him get a white octane from a very rare trade up it's like oh so it can happen to some people you know if you just open up enough of them but i've opened up a lot i've opened up quite a bit and i'm just unlucky in certain aspects I'm not gonna sit here and say I'm unlucky after getting two black markets and two exotics, but I'm unlucky getting the specific exact item that I want. But overall, in general, my luck is pretty good. Not gonna lie. Burnt Sienna Comet, there we go. 13 more. And then I'm gonna speed through the trade-ups at the end. Probably not gonna show them to you unless it's something good. And then I'll just show you the black market trade-up. <clears throat> Very rare, Bob's Ramen, okay. But if you guys didn't know, Gold Zombas are currently in the shop. They'll be in the shop for 24 more hours uh, as of posting this video. So make sure to go use code Coral Coke if you're going to go pick those up. I think they're like 800, 900 credits. Domain, okay. Uh, but yeah, the April Fool's joke yesterday was basically they put in a Rick roll in the item shop and then the quick chats were like a mixture of Rick rolls and really nice chat messages and then they also have like this egg mode where you play rocket league with an egg see like in here i don't not a huge i like the three wheeled joke they did last year a little bit better honestly that one mm, i'm not a huge fan of them just changing the ball into something else like with halloween that's twice this year halloween they changed it into a pumpkin okay and then Easter now, around Easter time, they change it into an egg. It's like, a little more creativity maybe? Because like, it just, it's Rocket League, but less fun and more annoying is basically what it is. Like, I don't know. Oh, Sky Blue Reapers? Dude, those look sick. Let's go. I can't remember the last time I got a painted Reaper from a crate. I remember I got white Reapers uh, during my first Trihouse crate battle, but Man, these are nice. Okay, let's go. Four more. I'm gonna have to tell Tryhouse about my luck with this opening because that was a little frustrating in our battle. Just not getting anything good whatsoever. Like that is the most frustrating part of great battles because you love getting good luck because it makes the battle way more intense, obviously. But yeah, definitely the first half of this opening was way better than the second half. Uh, <laughs> our luck in the first eight. Man, that is unmatched. 
but uh, since we're on the last crate now, that means we cannot get four, which means this isn't my best crate opening, but it's it's up there. It's top five for sure. Here we go, last crate, and it's a rare. All right. And it's a lone wolf. Okay, so I'm going to speed through the trade-ups quick, and we'll just uh, go to the black market one at the end. <gasps> oh, no, honey. Okay, uh, let's show archive. Oh, oh, God, this is going to hurt. Okay, golden gift 22. Golden gift 22. Golden gift 22. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Do we do it? <laughs> okay, this is going to trigger some people. But listen, listen, guys, okay? You can complain all you want. I waste so many credits with these videos anyways. Wasting a little bit more by trading up some valuable stuff. It's not gonna hurt me, okay? I make money from the videos, I make money from the sponsor. I'll be okay. Just just look away if this hurts you. Crimson Zombas and uh, Titanium White Dynamo. We're getting rid of them, sorry. We'll keep the Black Zombas and the Gray Dracos. Here we go. Titanium White Mainframe, please! Come on! Okay, that hurt a little bit. Yep, that hurt. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And uh, we'll catch you in the next one. Peace!